Hello and what's up guys, welcome back to my channel. Do you get a problem? Theme preview is currently unavailable after updating the blogger theme on your blogger side? If yes, then you are at the right place to fix your issue. Make sure you watch this video till the end so that you will be able to solve your issue. Without wasting any more time, let's dive into the solution. The first thing all you need to do is that replace your theme with another one. There are a lot of cool and free themes available on the web for blogger. The real issue arises when you are using premium blog theme for free or using theme which is being cracked by hacker. When starting out blogging career, probably most of the newbie blogger made this simple mistake. They think when they put up the very cool and fancy blogger theme, they will gonna attract more visitors to their site and improve website ranking and a lot more expectation. And there is nothing wrong for a newbie blogger to have this expectation. What I am trying to say is, if you are using premium or paid blogger theme for free, then replace your theme with another free blog theme. If you really want to get it from this issue, you have to follow these simple tips. ONBL, I am using purchase blogger theme and I am still having this issue. What should I do then? Well, you should follow up method 2. Send feedback to blogger. Sometimes sending feedback to blogger or Google is also one of the most practical way to banish your current issue. If you think your issue is coming from blogger server, then you should send feedback or get help from blogger help. Once they look up your issue, they will gonna fix their blogger server issue if it is coming from server or they will reply your email about the solution of your issue. To send feedback to blogger, follow this simple step. First of all, go to Google and search blogger help on search bar. Now head over to the first link, tap on left top side menu, tap on submit feedback option. Now briefly explain your problem here. As I already written out my problem, now I am going to paste it here. You can copy this text from description box if you want to write, if you don't want to write. Once you copy that, make some edit if it is needed. Now you can click on send option at the right side at the top right side finally your issue has been sent now let's just wait for google feedback about your issue you start your blog site from scratch if the above mentioned method doesn't work for you then there is a last hope for you to fix your issue. I know it might sound very annoying but it is very necessary to start your blog site from scratch. If the above method doesn't work for you then you should definitely start your blog site from scratch. If you already written blog post and you don't want to start your new blog site 
in that case you could download your all blog posts and then after creating your new blog site you will able to upload your download blog post on your new site if you don't know how to do it just follow this simple step go to your favorite browser and search blogger.com go to your dashboard of your blogger scroll down and tap on the setting option scroll down and find out the manage blog section once you find out tap on backup content tap on download now save your content once you save that now let's create new blog site Once you create new blog site, go back to the previous section that is manage blog. Now import your content. Wait for a few minutes to import your content here. Now refresh your page. As you can see here guys, my all content were imported here. Hopefully this video helped you to fix your issue. Make sure you subscribe our channel so that you could enjoy the trustworthy and well researched video on regulated issue. Have a great day guys. Bye bye. Whenever you have any tech related problems, feel free to post on our Facebook community. We will guide and assist you to solve your problem for absolutely free. All you have to do is that share a video or a snapshot of your problem. To join our Facebook community, check out the link in the description box.